So you finished lesson two, uh, UN Logistics at Work, and you have a good understanding of all those new support initiatives the UN is doing to improve efficiency and the effectiveness. Uh, countries that are committing troops and equipment to UN peacekeeping mission have to maintain a minimum standard of support and they also get reimbursed for their contributions of personnel, major equipment, and uh, self-sustainment. And it's through something called the contingent owned equipment, which is what you're going to cover now in lesson three. It all starts with a memorandum of understanding. It's like a contract between the UN and a particular country. So you'll learn the responsibilities of every party in uh, fulfilling that contract. You'll learn the principles of the COE and the different categories of contingent owned equipment management. Learn about what mission factors can apply to increase the amount of money countries will get. How loss and damage of major equipment is handled. Thank you very much.